Randall here with huntersfix.com. I'm doing a gear review today on the Scout Guard SG550V. This camera is really, uh, it's been really dependable. I've had it for a couple of years now. Uh, it's it's made, uh, it's got a, it's got a lot of the components as um, the Bushnell trophy cams do as far as the operating system goes. So it's really user friendly. Uh, it's got your, it's got your, uh, your LEDs in here, so it's got you know got quite a few of them. It it takes pretty good for for as little of uh, LEDs that it has. It actually takes pretty good night night pictures. Uh, down here in the bottom, if you take this this case off here, uh, this is where your your batteries and everything go in here. It runs on on uh, eight batteries, just like most of the other cameras do. Uh, your SD card goes in here. This this particular model can only hold a two gig SD card. Uh, it's pretty user friendly. It's really pretty simple actually. To actually set up the camera and to use it, you have to. Uh, there's this controller here that it comes with. It's a little remote control, and you actually plug. Actually has you know a little USB type style plug. You just plug it into the. Just plug it into the bottom of the bottom of it here, and then the remote control is what you use to actually program it, set all your settings. Like I said, it's a lot like the Bushnell uh, Trophy Cam setup. So, I mean, if you've used those, they're really simple to use. Uh, so that's that's how you set this camera up. It's kind of different, but it works good. Uh, this camera here. It retails, I believe, right around right around two hundred dollars, somewhere around there. Uh, it's been a great camera for me. Like I said, I've had it a couple of years. I did have a problem with this hinge here, where the battery batteries go in. This hinge here, this piece here, cracked, and so I had to call Scout Guard, and they sent me sent me a new one. Uh, cost me like two dollars for the part, and then I just had to take it apart, just unscrew it here put the new piece in and screw it back in. Um, so, I mean, it's it's a great camera. It's all camouflage. It does what you need it to do. It, it is a five megapixel camera. It takes pretty good night pictures. It's really sm small and compact and durable. Uh, so another one of those cameras that I, I would recommend. I, you know, I, on all my reviews, I've, I've recommend, recommended every camera that I've, you know that I've done a review on and and the reason is is because they've all worked really well uh, I'm you know with my reviews there's when I when I say stuff it, it's completely true I don't sugarcoat anything if there's something I don't like about a camera or a pack or whatever I'm doing a review on I'm gonna tell you about it because you know I want you guys to to refer to me and and to to know that when when you're looking for something for a new product or something to try and you don't know a whole lot about it I'm hoping that you'll you'll you know watch my my review and 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 know that I'm I'm being honest with you and 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 so um, anyways another thing with this with this camera here is it's got right here it's got the groove for that the cable the lock the snake cable lock I don't use it. Uh, it also has strap, you know, strap holes here and here. Again, I don't use those either. I actually use uh, lock boxes for most of my cameras. Some of my cameras I don't, but most of them I do. Um, in my other reviews, I've mentioned that here in Utah, the theft is pretty theft is pretty heavy, um, and so I, I like to lock box my more expensive cameras, my nicer cameras, and that way it's just one more security that I don't have to worry about somebody actually taking my camera. Now uh, another nice thing with speaking of, of theft, uh, the LEDs here, um, they don't flash so if somebody happens to walk by your camera it's not gonna it's not gonna alert them that there's a trail camera there because it, it's just it just glows red it's a really subtle red glow so you know it's that's another thing why I like all my cameras are LED. I don't have any flash cameras just just for that that reason. Uh, some people say that the flash scares scares game. I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't really noticed a difference. 
So, anyways, uh, just really wanted to let you guys know about the Scout Scout Guard SG 550V. Uh, it's a really good camera, good good value. Uh, and like I said, I haven't had any problems. The only problem I did have was with that battery, and they sent me the piece, and I fixed it, and it's working great. So, uh, huntersfix.com. Stay tuned for the next one.